Good day viewers and thanks for tuning in to Polymer Update TV, the world's first and only TV network with a free petrochemicals news show. You are watching the petrochemical market synopsis with me, Shreyal Dhume. It is Thursday, April 28th. Let's start with energy and feedstock news. The Energy Information Administration reported a drop in gasoline and distillate stocks, which pushed crude oil prices higher on Wednesday. Concerns about dwindling global oil supply also contributed to the minor price increase. Brent crude prices jumped 33 cents to 105 US dollars 32 cents per barrel, while WTI futures rose by 32 cents to 102 US dollars 2 cents per barrel. Open spec NAFTA prices galloped higher by 38 US dollars per metric ton to 903 US dollars per metric ton CFR Far East Asia levels. Despite higher upstream crude and NAFTA prices, ethylene prices in Asia fell on Wednesday. The price decrease was aided by reports of unfavorable market conditions in important markets such as China. Propylene prices were as stable in Asia on Wednesday, despite higher upstream energy values. Buying sentiments were reported to be dull in the region. Let's take a look at China Dalian Commodity Exchange for today on April 28, 2022. LLTP prices are down by 19 RMB per metric ton at 8,662 RMB per metric ton. PP prices are stable at 8,580 RMB per metric ton. PVC prices are steady at 8,671 RMB per metric ton. MEG prices are lower by 24 RMB per metric ton at 4,660 RMB per metric ton. Moving forward to plant news, Kyo Ethylene has brought on stream its cracker in Shiba. The company recently restarted the cracker in end April 2022. The cracker was shut on April 14, 2022, owing to a technical glitch. Looking at Shiba in Japan, the cracker has an ethylene production capacity of 768,000 metric ton per year and a propylene production capacity of 450,000 metric ton per year. Our special newsreel today is sponsored by Surat based MRK Industries LLP, one of the largest sellers of packaging film in India. MRK Industries LLP offer a full range of packaging films from 7 to 70 microns which include BOPP films, CPP films, metallized films and PET films. If you like our video, don't forget to click on the bell icon to subscribe to our free news channel and like this video by giving us a thumbs up. It motivates us to continue to bring you this free informative news service on a daily basis. That's all for today's Polymer News. Watch our daily news video tomorrow to know more. This is Polymer Update with me, Shreyal Dume from Mumbai. Many thanks for watching.